Hello everyone, my name is Emma and today we are going to be doing a beautiful stretchy stretch session. <laughs> so hopefully we'll be able to stretch out all of those areas that need a bit of a stretch. It's only going to be about 20 minutes long, so not too long. Um, but yeah, hopefully it will be really, really lovely and hopefully you'll enjoy. No equipment needed for today, just your beautiful selves and your beautiful mat. Let's get started. Okay, so jumping down onto the mat, bringing those knees out wide, big toes together, just sinking those hips down, coming into your child's pose, bringing your hands out in front of you and just enjoying that nice stretch here. Really sinking those hips right back, stretching those arms out nice and long. Take a deep inhale. And a big exhale out. One more time here, inhale. And exhale out. Beautiful work, just rolling up the spine here. Beautiful, and coming into your four point kneeling position, we inhale, we drop the belly open high. Exhale, round the spine. Inhale. And exhale. One more time here. Inhale. Drop that belly. And exhale. We round through. Beautiful. Coming back into four point kneeling position here. Lift that left arm up towards the sky. Really open up into that chest. And exhale. We thread that left arm underneath the right here. Coming into. A nice shoulder stretch. Breathing. <sighs> Wonderful work. Just bringing that arm up towards the sky here. Lifting up, bringing that left hand and holding on to your left ankle here and just rolling through the spine. Enjoying that nice back body stretch here. Inhale. And exhale, use your abdominals to help you bring yourself back up to that four point kneeling position. Beautiful work. Let's take that right arm up towards the sky, look up. And exhale, we thread it under that left arm, getting that nice twist here. Beautiful work. When you're ready, bringing that right arm up and all the way back here grabbing onto that right ankle and enjoying that nice stretch out. Beautiful work, using your abdominals to lift you back up here. Coming into that four point kneeling position, tuck those toes underneath your bum and rolling on to your backs here. Wonderful work. When you're ready, bringing both knees into the chest, Grab onto your knees and um, grab onto your elbows. So you're bringing your knees in really quite tight and you should feel a nice release through those hip flexors. You can rock a little bit side to side. You can close down those eyes if you wish. <sighs> Wonderful work. And when you're ready, grabbing onto those knees with your hands, we're just going to rotate those knees out to one side and then bring them in through center. So just releasing that lower back here, let it um, come up. So you're having a nice little massage in that lower back. And just reverse. Beautiful. And coming into your happy baby here. So grabbing onto the, either the soles of the feet or your ankles here and just focus on bringing those knees down towards your ribs. You can rock side to side if you'd like here. Or you can stay still and focus on bending, bringing those knees down towards your mat. 
Or you can straighten out one leg if you want, bend through the other leg. And then straighten through the other leg. Whatever you fancy doing. Beautiful work. And coming back to center, just bringing the soles of the feet together now, grabbing onto those ankles or those shins and just opening up those inner thighs here. Wonderful work. And just planting those feet down. And when you're ready, just bring the soles of the feet together and just open up those legs. You can have your hands by your side if you'd like. Or if you'd like a little bit of a chest opener, you can bring those hands up above your head. Those arms are just mirroring those legs. And you can just stay here and close down those eyes and relax. <laughs> Beautiful, and when you're ready, just bringing those hands to your legs and closing those legs like a book. Grabbing onto that right knee now, or right shin. You can keep that left foot planted if you'd like, or you can straighten it out. You're just rotating that knee around one way, and then reverse. Wonderful work, bringing it back into center now. We're gonna extend that leg nice and long and come into a hamstring stretch. So holding onto either your calf here, you can hold onto your ankle, or you can hold onto your thigh. Just don't hold on behind the knee, yeah? And when you're ready, start to rotate that foot one way and then the other way. Good, let's point and flex that foot. Point and flex, lovely. You can bring that nose towards your knee if you'd like a little bit more of a deeper stretch here. Just breathe. And when you're ready, just start to roll back down. Bringing that knee back into your center here, grab onto it with that opposite arm. And we inhale to prepare and exhale, we twist over, coming into that beautiful supine twist here. This is like my all time favorite twist. All time favorite stretch. It's just so beautiful. And close down those eyes. And when you're ready, just coming back to center, grabbing onto that leg and just coming into a tree pose here. So it's like a lying tree pose. So you're just bringing the sole of that foot towards that inner thigh and just opening up that hip here. You can press down on that leg if you'd like a little bit more just try to make sure that that left um hip socket isn't a uh, left sorry left glute isn't coming off the mat just try and keep everything nice and planted down good and if you would like you can hold on to that leg and bring it up to get that nice inner thigh stretch here it's it's up to you if you want to do this though no problem no problem if not quite a deep stretch. Good, and bending through that leg and just bringing it back into that tree pose and closing it up. Just grabbing onto your other leg now. Again, you can keep that right leg planted or you can extend that right leg out long. Just rotating that knee round one way and then the other way. Good. 
And then when you are ready, we're going to extend that leg out nice and long here. And you can rotate that foot one way and then the other way. You can flex and point that foot. And if you'd like, you can bring your knees towards, knees, your nose towards your knee. Good, and coming back down. Beautiful work, bending through that leg now. We inhale to prepare and exhale, we twist over, coming into our supine twist here. And close down those eyes if you'd like. And coming back to center, wonderful work. Just bringing that knee out now into that tree pose. So that lying tree pose here, trying to keep, the, keep those hips nice and even. And if you would like, you can extend that leg out to the side. Just try and keep that sit bone, that um, glute nice and planted down on the mat. It's a really intense stretch this, so. Good, and then coming back in to that tree pose and then closing that leg, beautiful. Just bringing those knees back into your chest and rock side to side here. And when you're ready, bringing those hands underneath those legs and just rock and roll up to seated. Beautiful work. Okay, we are going to bring our uh, right leg out nice and long. That left foot is just in the inseam in of your leggings or your inner thigh, right off. We are going to um, inhale, lift that right arm, left arm up towards the sky and exhale, we're gonna fold over towards that right leg. Getting that nice side body stretch in here. Beautiful, and when you come up, you're gonna plant that right left hand down behind that left hip and you're gonna inhale, lift that body up and come into that beautiful wild thing posture here. Oh, such a beautiful stretch. And then you're gonna drop down and we're gonna fold back over. And let's do that two more times because it's so beautiful. Slowly coming down and bending over. One more time here. Just opening up that body, beautiful. And coming back down, bending over. And coming back up, awesome work. Just bringing your hips towards that front leg now. We're gonna inhale, lift those arms up towards the sky and exhale, we fold over that front leg. And just slowly rolling up one vertebra at a time. Beautiful, let's come to the other side. So that left leg goes out, that right foot comes in to your inner thigh. We inhale, lift that left arm, right arm up towards the sky and exhale, fold over. I'm normally not so bad with my left and right, so I don't know what's going on. Okay, that beautiful side body stretch. And when you're ready, we're gonna bring that right hand behind that right hip here and we lift up. Have that beautiful opening 
in that body. Wonderful work and coming back down. Whew. And we have two more of these. And coming back down. And last one here. Enjoy it. Beautiful. And coming back down. And lifting up. Wonderful work. This time, bring your hips to face that left leg. We inhale, lift those arms up towards the sky and we fold over that left leg. Beautiful. Again, your foot can be flexed or pointed here. You can bend through that knee if you need to. Just breathing. And when you're ready, just rolling up. Nice work, awesome guys. So let's now bring both legs together here. Just move the fleshy parts of your bottom away to the side so you can try and sit up nice and tall here. Have a slight bend through those knees. We inhale, lift those arms up towards the sky and we bend over, getting that nice forward fold stretch here. Just drop that chin down. You might feel a nice nervy stretch in the back of your neck here. Taking a few deep breaths. Wonderful work and just start rolling back up. Beautiful work. Okay, let's just have a quick glute stretch here and then we'll all finish up. So bringing your right foot over your left, puff up into the chest here and just push that right knee away. Really make sure that you're not sinking down into your shoulders here. We're staying nice and lifted, nice proud chest. You should feel beautiful stretch down this leg. Wonderful work. And then just heel toe that left foot over, plant that right foot down. We inhale, we grab onto it with our left hand and exhale, we twist over. Good, and coming back to center here, just bringing your two knees together. And you can either bring the two knees together or you can have shin on shin like this, or bring that right leg in front of you here. I'm gonna do two knees. I'm gonna inhale to prepare. This might be totally fine for you just to stay up nice and tall here. Or if you'd like a little bit more, let's start to fold forward. Beautiful. And you can do a little massa uh, massage. <laughs> you can do a little fist on fist, yeah. And you can rest your forehead down if you'd like. Getting a deeper glute stretch. Good, and coming back up. Just taking it straight over to the other side now. So your left ankle goes over that right knee. Press up into the chest so you're not sinking into those shoulders. Beautiful. Enjoying that beautiful glute stretch here down this side of your leg. Breathe into it. <laughs> and when you're ready, heel toe that right foot over towards the left, grab onto that knee with your right hand arm and just rotate over towards the left hand side here. Getting that beautiful rotation. Mm -hmm. 
And when you're ready, coming back to center, bringing your knee on knee, shin on shin, or that left foot in front of that right. You might sit up tall here and that might be enough of a stretch for you, or you can come down, walk yourself down, you can be on your elbows, drop that head down. You can even do your fist on fist and drop that head down. And close down your eyes if you would like. We're nearly finished here. And when you're ready, start to roll up. Just pressing those legs. Sitting up nice and tall. You can sit up on a block or a cushion if, you, if you'd like, if you find that more comfortable. Let's just do some uh, neck rolls here. So bringing your right ear to your right shoulder and just slowly bringing it over towards the other side. So just a half neck circle here. It should feel really nice. Beautiful, and then towards the back here. Just be really gentle. And coming back to center, and you can do a full circle if you like. Again, being really, really gentle. And taking it to the other side. Beautiful work, coming back up to center. Just bring your chin down to your chest now. So you can come towards, bring your ear to, right ear towards your right shoulder. And then you can just drop your chin down, coming into a diagonal stretch. You should feel like a nice little stretch out through your trapezius and through your pec muscle here. Such a beautiful stretch if you sit a lot at a desk. And then rolling up and coming to the other side. So left ear to left shoulder. And then you can drop that chin down and come on the diagonal here. Oh, I feel it so much more on this side actually. Beautiful work and just coming back to center. Just rolling those shoulders out one way and then the other way. Beautiful, inhale, lift those arms up towards the sky. And exhale, bring those hands to your center and bring them down to your heart. Dropping that chin to your chest. Taking a few moments here for yourself. Taking a few deep breaths. Thanking yourself and thanking your body for taking that time for you taking that time to stretch out your beautiful body and just for giving yourself that time to slow down. Take another big breath here. And big exhale out. Slowly blinking, open those eyes and bring your head back up to center. Thanks so much for joining me today, everyone. I hope you enjoyed that lovely juicy stretch. Again, it was a pretty quick stretch and we focused a lot on our legs, but we also stretched out the rest of our body as well. <laughs> Am I making any sense? generally not making any sense. So I'm going to leave you. I'm feeling nice and floaty and I hope you are too. Enjoy the rest of your day guys and I'll see you soon. Thanks so much.